For most of you, your GitHub looks like this, very boring and simple. But we can transform it into this, very interesting and colorful. So, we are going to transform your GitHub today. But before that, please like, share and subscribe to the channel. And yes, 26% of you, only 26% have subscribed. Please subscribe to the channel and let's transform our GitHub profile. Okay, so this is my GitHub profile and as you can see I have written, I have uh, made a banner and here I have written Hi, I am Kushbu Koyal, a girl trying to figure out stuff and uh, I have added a view and it got my portfolio link, it got my email ID, a fun fact and all my social media and tools I know and uh, languages and my GitHub stats and all. Okay, so like... uh. So I have made it very recently. I saw someone's, I saw one of my friend's profile and I got very excited about it. So, so then I learned it how to do and it is very easy and we are going to do that now. I am going to open, I am going to open it like in another tab also. So, uh, as it is done already, so we don't have a white canvas. So I will show you that how you can do it. Uh, but I'm not going to make mine because when I was making mine, I don't, I didn't have the idea that I will be shooting this video. Okay. So first of all, what you need to do is you need to go to the this uh, plus tag and you need to make a new repository. Okay. And when you are making the new repository, the name of the repository should be your username, your GitHub username. So like mine is Kushbu Goyal 01. So when I will write kushpu goel 01 so like you see uh, it is showing you found a secret this is a special repository that you can use at a, a readme dot and this is showing uh, like the repository is already exist because i have already made this so when you will make this it will not give some error like this okay and make sure like it is public here and make sure that you take the add a readme part and then you can create a repository okay so after you have created a new repository it will so after you have created a new repository it will look something like this like i will show you wait a minute so it will look something like this this will be blank and here will be a readme.md which is blank so what you need to do is you need to go into it and you need to edit it and here uh, and value uh, when you will be editing it so you will see some stuff written over here that is like the suggestions and all so you can either just like uh, completely blank it and use it so uh, uh, what i am going to do is i am going to completely uh, like erase it so that you can see what i am doing okay so uh, like let's completely erase everything that i have written till now yes so i have erased everything so it is showing only uh, four lines uh, and preview changes in the preview changes like you can see the changes that are going to happen so uh, like so the red line in the left means like these all the parts are deleted so these are are all the deleted parts okay so now we are going to write so there is a tool that I found that uh, makes it super easy to make your GitHub profile. So I will share the link. Uh, the link is in the description. You can check it out. And uh, wait a minute, I will open that link here. So this is the link. The link is also in the description and uh, GitHub profile readme generator. Okay so like hi i am kushbu goel and like uh, here you can write anything you want and it will create a mark markdown for that so basically like i have written a lot of things here but if like uh, maybe i have deleted the subtitle i delete the uh, uh, my email i delete my portfolio link and uh, uh, I uh, fun fact is there I think I am funny and let's just uh, take only one language C++ uh, okay and let's take a bootstrap here and HTML and CSS and 
so these are all the things you can choose from so and let's just uh, also remove the uh, get up part and let's just keep the and let's just keep our social medias here and here are a lot of things like you can display visit uh, visitors and github trophies and top skills twitter badge or like all the things latest action latest medium post uh, and latest blogs so uh, like now i will say generate my github markdown so this is the markdown so we can preview it we don't if you we think that maybe it is not good so we can see it so i'm kushbu goel uh, we have added the profile views we added the trophies that was uh, trophies are here so you can uh, so you can just directly copy the markdown so from here the markdown you can just directly copy the markdown and when you will write that thing here you can also preview it here also you can preview it here also so here's all the things like uh, the red part is that is deleted and the green part is that is newly added so like so it will be difficult for you to understand like this i'm so sorry so let's just preview here only because it is going to be difficult to understand like that and yeah so uh, so from here you can create your github profile and now let's talk about so so this was my original so this is my original profile so now so uh i have added my pro portfolio from here only the headings and the profile views uh email and fun facts and the all the things uh this is a gif that i have added and this is a banner that i have added or uh, that i have uh, added more so let's uh, see how we can add them okay so for edit file so here you can uh, what you can do is so what i will do is i will copy the same text in the description box so you can directly copy from there or what you can do is you can just fork this repository fork you can fork this here from here and you can edit everything and from where uh, there are my names you can just change your names and you can create your like uh, mostly like you can create a similar github profile so uh, here uh, so for the master head here where this is like here the full link you have to provide the link for the banner if you have made any maybe you can use canva for that and here you can and here you can provide the alternate link if you want to add the image if you want to add the image that i have added so basically i'm talking about this gif that uh, i found very cool and so uh, okay i have taken it from the side dribble so you can uh, just use the image tag so img i have aligned it right and alternative text you can write anything and i have given it a perfect width and you have to write just source here you can add the link to that uh, image or the gif you want to add or if that is not available on the internet you want to add your own then you can just add it in your github repository and from there you can get that link and it will show here up here so that's the thing and just after that and you can just keep you can just keep previewing the changes so that you know what is uh, what it's going to look like and after you are satisfied you can just commit the changes and it will like it will happen okay and that's it and you have created your amazing github profile uh you can be extra creative with it you can add a lot of stuff you can remove a lot of stuff from here like this is what i uh, this is how i like my profile but there are a lot of inspiration out there these are these are some uh so this is a very cool so i found this very cool so here are a lot and lot of github profiles so you can find inspiration here and you can just uh 
you can just see their code and learn from that and you can modify it so i i have taken like i have taken the banner thing from here i have uh, so uh, my profile is like the uh, chosen element i like from these profiles so you can do the same thing and i hope you find this helpful and give my repository a start if you liked it i know this is short and exciting and yeah please subscribe to the channel like this video comment down below and i will see you all next time bye